Welcome to the Collecting Kites. Collecting memories and treasures in New Zealand. Hello there and welcome to the Collecting Kites. I'm Jane Kite and I'm here to share with you my latest haul. A haul video if you will. Now first I'm going to try on the two items I have. Ah, here we go. The first, I absolutely love old hats. Sometimes they don't tend to fit me, but these two are beautiful. Now this one is Creations by Widdelly, made in Auckland, which is cool. Look how neat that is. I love that. Striker pose. Ah! Look at the beautiful bow on it. I love this. These two hats and one of the brooches I bought were from Hidden Treasures, which is amazing, an amazing shop in Morrinsville, where the big, huge mega cow is. Yeah, Hidden Treasures, fantastic. Now, this one is Annette's Attic Design and Made New Zealand hat. I like this thing to the side, I think. Look at the detail in this. I like this little, little chuli bit off to the side. Look at the detail. How neat is that? So, yeah, these two were only $5 from Hidden Treasures. Amazing. So cool. Uh, I'll also show you the um, the tags inside as well. So this one, Annette's Attic, Design and Made New Zealand. It's got the comb in it. Very cool. And this one, with the lovely bow. <laughs> and it's obviously like a fake, a fake fur. Uh, Creation by Widdelly, made in Auckland, which is New Zealand's biggest city. It's got the corduroy uh, bow and trim around it. I love that. It's so cool. Hidden treasures, amazing. And they put up with me trying on all the hats as well. Lovely owners there. Now, this is a brooch I actually did get from Hidden Treasures today as well. I don't know whether you can see the beautiful colour in that, but it's almost like a brown topaz type stone the three big ones there and then there's the little diamante and brownie ones around now this has got a very very unusual clasp I've never seen a clasp like it it op operates the opposite to a normal clasp and it is it has got a marking there that i can't make out but again i don't buy things because they're marked i buy them because i like them and as soon as i bought it i started wearing it but the clasp, um, because it's very unusual, it's a little bit tricky to get on, but I managed to get it on. Um, but I just think it's something very, very special because of that clasp as well. Never seen it. Okay, and then, so these three items were from Hidden Treasures, and this is from a lovely shop in Paidoa. Look at that. I'll try and get closer to it. Look at the vibrancy in that. It's just absolutely stunning. I'll turn it around so you can see it in different different lights. Look at that for a brooch. Beautiful. And again, this one is not marked. Or unlike the other one, this is not marked that I can see. But it's just, it's beautiful. It's quite large too. But yeah, statement piece. Both of these brooches are beautiful. And then last but not least that I purchased from the Central Flea Market is this Villaroy and Bosch plate. And it's just a little cutie. And it came with the little stand, which I thought was neat. And it is Acapulco. Aca, oh, am I saying that right? Acapulco, made in Luxembourg. Villaroy and Bosch. So that's very, very cool. Am I going to be able to pop that back on? Oh, yeah, there we go. So there we go, guys. That is my little haul video. Hopefully you uh, enjoyed watching me buy the hats. If you haven't already seen it, check out the Hidden Treasures uh, video. It's a really great store in Morrinsville, the heart of the Waikato district. North Island, New Zealand. Yeah, so hopefully you enjoyed that whole video and I'll see you later, guys. Bye. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. We'll see you later, guys.